Hey guys, it's Miraline, Delicious Delights. Welcome to my channel. So today I have a little small haul of one bottle. <laughs> Uh, one bottle and some samples but you know what I love doing unboxings I love sharing with you guys what I get and um, yeah this one is just not some ordinary whatever bottle this to me is a unicorn I have been on the hunt for this bottle for a long time since I first tested it a uh, long time ago I did a first impressions on it and um, I was like ooh, I would like to have a bottle of that finally I found a bottle it's in here. I got a friend of mine to send it over to me and then we uh, also uh, got some samples in here and I'll just uh, open it up here off camera so I don't hurt myself with this. <laughs> and I'll share with you guys my uh, unicorn perfume purchase. It has like bubble wrap and then it has more bubble wrap around it. Ooh. I'm gonna leave this one till the end, but I'll just go through the samples. And these are ones you'll probably hear me talk about at some point uh, on the channel. So these are all a bunch of Zerzhov perfumes. First one is Zerzhov Soprano. Zerzhov Fatal Charm. For the th I think this is part of the Join the Club collection. Uh, Zerzhov Ceylon. I'm really looking forward to this one because Ceylon is a type of tea. Uh, I'll cut. Mamluk. I think I talked about this one before. Uh, Oudi, sweet oud kind of perfume. Uh, Luxor. This is uh, Malaysia. Probably saying that wrong. Then we also have La Capitale. Is this a new one? I believe this is a new release or a newer release. There's some more in here. Dawn. This one is from also the Join the Club collection. Overture. Apollonia. Uh, there's so many. There's some more. <laughs> Um, Cruise del Sur 2, I've talked about this one. This was a fragrance that uh, has mango in it. I had really high hopes, like a milky mango, and I had really high hopes for this one, but uh, kind of fell short for me, unfortunately. Uh, just a sec, there's more other stuff in here. Lots of packing peanuts. And I believe that's all we got for the samples. So if you guys, if you guys can let me know which one of those, um, which one of those Zerzhov perfumes you'd like me to talk about first, then just let me know in the comments. So let me just get into this little package here. And this is my unicorn perfume. I believe it's discontinued and now it's very difficult to find. Okay. really good job with <laughs> wrapping this up. A lot of tape and stuff and, and bubbles. And now we have another layer of bubbles here. Anticipation is building. <laughs> Alright, so the unicorn perfume that I got is from the house of Ellie Saab. This is uh, part of their more private collection. And um, here is the beautiful box. And the perfume that I fell in love with is Amand Tonka. Kind of blurry. Amand Tonka. Almond and Tonka. And it says here, I'll just uh, read out a little write-up. Uh, this is a 100 milliliter bottle. Parfums Ellie Saab, The Light of Now. I guess it says here it's a magazine. Anyways, okay, so Essence number 10, La, Cal La Cal Collection des Essences. <laughs> Almond essence blends with tonka bean to weave a voluptuous and subtle palette of almondy nuances. 
So yeah, I uh, really am enjoying the um, almond and tonka, well, mostly tonka. I love tonka as a note, but I've been really into the tonka notes lately. So let's open this up. It comes with a little card here. Uh, I'll just read it out because I want to know what it says. You can forward this part if you want. <laughs> Um, yeah, but it's a nice little detail. Inspired by the most outstanding works of art, La Collection des Essences Elisab is composed of exceptional fragrances crafted with the quality and rigor inherent to, inherent to haute couture. A tribute to the subtle gradient of shades adorning the fabrics of Elisab's sublime dresses, Essence No. 10, Amon Tonka, is a voluptuous weave of smooth almondy nuances. Now let's open up the thing here. Oh, it's beautiful. Look. Beautiful. Very simplistic, heavy, chunky bottle. It has a lot of weight. It has like a little slanted part there. I just love it, you guys. And so, yeah, let's uh, get my nose on this again. has a little detail up there with the uh, the logo. All right, so Amanda Tonka. <sighs> to me, it's smoky, sweet, a smoky almond scent with a smoky Tonka. <sighs> kind of benzoin, syrupy-ish but not overly sticky. Um, I think I get some sweetness from vanilla here too, which is similar to Tonka. Well, they both have a sweetness, um, but there is some kind of dark earthiness in this fragrance. Maybe if you were to roast the, the almonds and then roast it a little bit over, over the point where it kind of gets a little bit toasty and a little bit burnt but just a tiny tiny little bit so you get a little tiny bit of an over roasted uh, almond in here but that smokiness adds to a beautiful tonka vanilla sweetness too and a tonka vanilla smokiness along with some earthy i don't know what the notes are in here but i'm getting an earthy slightly dirty but super classy, maybe there's, hmm, let's see, a tiny bit of leather or something in here in the background, but mostly it's sweet tonka, uh, smoky, maybe some incense. It's just gorgeous and I love smoky scents, especially for the fall season. And I am definitely going to be wearing this for the cold weather and I'm loving it so much. It's it's amazing. I just love Tonka so much. Tonka Imperial is one of my most favorite Tonka perfumes or perfumes of all time. One of my favorites in my collection. And then I just got that perfume Toncade by Laboratorio Olfativo, which is also a smoky, dark, incense type of Tonka. And now this is a also a smoky, dark, incense -y kind of tonka, but it has a little, it's, it has something in here, like a twist. It's sweeter for sure. And uh, I love sweet, dark, smoky, mysterious, sexy perfumes. And this is definitely, uh, definitely one of those types. It would make me feel um, mysterious, kind of, I don't know. <laughs> extra fancy it has this I don't know there's just something very elegant about this perfume and sophisticated um, and I think this would be perfect also for men but this is just so fantastic and I'm so in love with it and I'm very 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 happy with this purchase so let me just pull up the notes here uh, so I can let you guys know for those of you who are interested uh, Amand just bear with me, I guess. <laughs> uh, Tonka, okay. 
So the notes, the main accords in this one are woody, almond, sweet, vanilla, aromatic, nutty, uh, amber, warm, spicy, fruity, balsamic. And 2017 was when this was released. And then the notes, there's only four listed. There's tonka bean, bitter almond, sandalwood, and amyris. <sighs> it just smells so expensive and bougie. I just love it. I love, love, love this so much. So yeah, that is my unicorn uh, perfume that I found at a unboxing and my impressions. And I am totally going to rock this this um, season, uh, winter, fall, and yeah. That's basically it. So uh, again, let me know which of the Zerzhov samples you'd like me to talk about. Um, uh, and also, if you have a favorite from this Ellie Saab Essence collection that you would recommend, I would love to hear uh, your thoughts on any of them because I've just been seeing them here and there on uh, discount web shops, uh, kind of interested on, in them, but this is the only one that I really had the chance to try properly. But if you have any other recommendations, I would love to hear that and which is your favorite. Also, if you've tried this, let me know in the comments what you think. And yeah, that's it for me for today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video unboxing. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time in the next video. Take care, bye-bye.